Hi everybody, Perry Kenny here with Kenny Systems Hair Design. Recently I had a viewer submit an issue that she was having with her hair and asked for some help with it and so I thought we'd offer some suggestions by way of this video and then uh, get your impressions as well. What do you do in this instance? You see she states to me that she's been color treating her hair and treating it really well by using high quality premium products but because of the uh, uh, nature of the product she uses, uh, it causes her hair to be a bit soft, a little over soft, makes her hair flat. Then she signs it, uh, well then she states that no matter how much hairspray she uses and or what kind of hairspray she uses, she can't maintain body or volume. And then she signs it flathead in Utah, which I think is really brave to sign it flathead in Utah. But okay, that's fine. Let's get out of the, the issue at hand, okay? Flathead in Utah. Here's the deal. When you are taking and you are using hairspray as both a finished product and a support product, what you're doing is really kind of counterintuitive to the way in which the product is designed. So let's do it this way. Let's take and put the a gel to start with. The hair is damp, you washed it, you're ready to get it to blow it dry, okay? But before you do, whether you've uh, used a conditioner or not, at this point, let's take and use a firm gel or mousse. So one of my favorites in this regard is to use the Strong Gel in the L'Oreal Professional line. I like that one. It does have a masculine fragrance, though. Got to mention that. Versa Gel in the Retro line. I like that one. That's a good one. Uh, let's see that mousse over there. What is that? Surface Mousse. Uh, no, Surface is the name of the product. Uh, Awaken Mousse is the name of the mousse. That's a really good one as well. You could use it. Any one of those. I can promise you this about those kinds, that, those types of products, the quality products, is they don't flake, and they do put shine in the hair, so they're really excellent. So perhaps you put them all over your head, or perhaps you put them just at the scalp or wherever you want, uh, on the sides of the scalp, uh, not on the ends. It's, it's kind of up to you. But then what you would do is afterwards is put your leave-in conditioner on the cold shaft and ends and use less of it. Maybe you just use it at the last, say your hair is really long, but it's only the last couple of inches that are very, uh, very uh, compromised. Well, then put it there. But don't put it necessarily everywhere. You don't have to, so don't. Now what you've done is you've introduced a polymer to the scalp and to the areas where you want body and volume. A polymer that is going to interact, or interact, I should say. Yes, interact. Interact. With the hairspray that when you finish up. So you blow dry it in, maybe you curl it, maybe you don't, it's up to you. Maybe you use a flat iron, maybe you don't, it's up to you. But in the final analysis, you're now going to use your hairspray. And when you do, don't you don't have to spray it you know, with constant movement and motion, but rather what you can do is just use spurts of hairspray, just short, you know, short little uh, sprays of it, because you don't need that much uh, hairspray now you have a support product in the hair. Now you're using the hairspray properly, you're going to use it as a finish product. The two polymers from the gel or the mousse and the hairspray are going to interlock. I mentioned the ones I like for support products. You know what I like for hairspray? I like the uh, Kenra Volume Spray. Uh, that's a really good one. In fact, it's won, it's won the uh, Stylist Cho Choice Award just several times. I really like that particular hairspray for this kind of work. And what you're going to do is you're just going to spray it at the scalp or wherever it is you put the uh, the gel or the mousse, and it's going to give you that bottom bo body, and it's going to interlock. It's going to last. So why don't you try that? That will work really well, and it'll hold not just the morning, but it'll hold pretty likely the whole day long. Give that a try and see what you think. Do you or uh, do do you have any additional questions? Please just leave them below. I hope I've answered them, but if if not, if I've missed anything, let me know. Uh, if you're watching this video and there's a way, a different way in which you do this kind of an approach, why don't you go ahead and mention it too, you know, get a couple of different opinions on how this can work. At any rate, I hope you have a good day and I thank you for writing in and encourage any of you. If you have any questions, go ahead and submit them and I want to thank you for your time in the meantime. Oh, by the way, if you're seeing this on YouTube, what, do they thumbs up? I guess that's what they do. Or they thumbs down, let me know what you think. If you're seeing it on Facebook or anything like that, leave a comment. Let us know what you like. I think you can like it on Facebook or can you dislike Well, anyway, whatever it is, whatever you think, let us know. Appreciate your time. You take care, and until next time, bye for now.